this first during the power washing and we're down this is the last bit that has to be power washed which is this area here and then going down the pathway to the little house And you can see the difference between the colors. And he's bringing back the nice red steps again. This is our big project for this year. There's some more, but this one is the one that has to get done. Well, it doesn't have to, but we want to. We were over at our daughter and son-in-law's house a couple days ago and our daughter had power washed just about everything in the backyard and it looked spectacular. She offered us their power washer to use to clean up our house and my husband said, sure. Oh, boy, was that a mistake. Remember me telling you we have the worst luck? Well, it hit on this, too. He worked on it for a day in the front driveway and got down to the end of the house and the patio. He had turned everything off. He came in to eat, and he went out, and it didn't work. And he worked on it and worked on it, and he couldn't get it working. And so he called the son-in-law, and he came over, and he couldn't figure out what was wrong. Well, he went and got his mother's power washer, and we started using that. And lo and behold, it had an aneurysm. It blew a big hole in the hose. The hose was twirling around our backyard. It was a grand mess. And of course, we broke that power washer. So, that particular one, we were able to get the part to fix. And son-in-law said, well, he would get the part. He would fix it. And what we offered was that we would buy a brand new one. We would use it to finish up our work here. And then they could keep it in their shed and use it because they will use it more than we will on little projects. And we don't have any there. We don't have that many little projects. It was this big project we wanted it for. So that's the disaster of us and the power washer. Well, this project is finished. It's all been cleaned. We were trying to figure out how long this walkway has been here. It has probably been about 12 years. And then we redid it again because the tree that was sending its roots up died. We had it taken down and decided we would redo this and it didn't matter. How many roots we chopped out because the tree was already gone and then shortly after that we decided to put in these pathways so we could get in and do our gardening and pull the weeds and we didn't have enough of everything so we kind of did a mishmash 
of putting it together and we got an eclectic walkway so you can see nothing is exactly the same but if you keep them all different they still look wonderful there's another one right here looks like I gotta get in there and pull some of the weeds or I'll have Bruce get in there with a weed killer But it looks so beautiful now. These steps going up to the patio. They're all clean. My white plastic chairs. He also power washed them. They're kind of rough now. But they are clean. So here it is from up here. Other than not having the grass cut, it looks like a park. Please take a second to comment, subscribe, ring the bell to get notices of new videos, and please give a thumbs up.